What's up, what's going on, Legends? Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm bringing us a quick mission guide for the Phalanx Faction Tier 3 mission here in Season 4, known as Go for a Drive. But before we dive into it, if you guys do enjoy this content at any time or find this video helpful in any way, make sure you share support for the channel by going down below and smashing that like button. Go and throw an easy goal of 150 likes on today's video, as well as if you would like to find your way back to the channel for more Call of Duty content, make sure you do hit that subscribe button. Like that notification bell so you don't miss you in future videos. All right, so this mission is going to be three parts and it is taking us over to Vondel. Part one is asking us to acquire an encrypted hard drive. Now, you guys have a couple options here. You guys could loot around the map mostly in computers they could have these and i did actually find one in the police station in one of the filing cabinets there however the best way to go about actually acquiring an encrypted hard drive is to wait for the point in the match when the supply drops actually come in the supply drops will drop you guys will then want to head over to one of these supply drops open it up and there's always a chance you'll get an encrypted hard drive so if you guys go to your first supply drop and you guys don't see one there maybe you'll head over to your second one it could be a little competitive depending on how many people actually go for these in your match but at some point you guys should be able to get access to an encrypted hard drive from a supply drop or looting computers or elsewhere around the map. Once you guys get access to the encrypted hard drive, part one will then be complete. Now part two just asks us to drive a chop top in Vondel for two consecutive minutes while carrying the encrypted hard drive. So now you have access to the hard drive, you're gonna open up your TAC map and you're gonna be looking for one of the chop top vehicles, which is the vehicle that doesn't have a top on it, of course. You guys are then gonna head over to it, jump in, and once you guys jump in and start driving, a progress bar will then pop up on your screen. Obviously, once this starts, you're not gonna wanna jump out of the vehicle as I think it does reset the progress. However, no, the vehicle does not have to be moving in order for the progress bar to be continuing so you guys basically could find somewhere safe and park as long as you guys are sitting within the vehicle this progress bar will continue i chose to kind of just park behind the wall over in the castle for a majority of this progress bar but then obviously towards the end i decided to drive to another location but you guys can either move around the map or hang out in the vehicle for that two minutes and once the progress bar is complete that will wrap up part two now part three is just asking us to deliver the hard drive to the dead drop at the zoo so for me i hung out again for a majority of that progress bar for part two then once i got to the point i knew whatever i had left would take me over to the zoo i then headed towards the zoo location if you guys open up your tac map you're going to want to go to the bottom left corner of the zoo location you guys go to the building to the left of the aquarium just below that or just behind that i should say is where the dead drop location is going to be as always i will do my best to show you guys this location on the map you guys will head over to this dead drop you guys will then dead drop this here at the zoo knocking out part three and completing this mission that's going to wrap things up for today's quick mission guide thank you guys for all supporting today's video all support in the channel and i look forward to seeing y'all in the next one. Peace.